Would you like to know how the world's top actors became the best at their profession? Join me as we discover and break down their greatest teachings, inspiring new actors everywhere to excel on stage and screen. We begin with Audrey Hepburn's advice on perseverance. I was asked to act when I couldn't act. I was asked to sing Funny Face when I couldn't sing, and dance with Fred Astaire when I couldn't dance, and do all kinds of things I wasn't prepared for. Then, I tried like mad to cope with it. Okay, let's break that down. Think of acting like climbing a mountain. When you start at the base, the summit looks far away and intimidating. You might think, I'm not ready for this. I don't have the skills to make it to the top. As you expect, when you start climbing, you face obstacles. Steep slopes, tricky paths, and even ground. But with each step, you overcome them. You learn, you adapt, and get stronger. By the time you reach the summit, you realise that the very challenges you feared were what helped you grow and reach new heights. In acting, you'll often be asked to do things you've never done before, singing, dancing or playing a character completely different from yourself. It's natural to feel unprepared or even overwhelmed, but those moments are opportunities for growth. Just like climbing that mountain, each challenge you face is a chance to push your limits and discover new strengths. When you're handed a role or a task that feels beyond your abilities, don't shy away from it. Instead, dive in and try like mad to cope with it. You might surprise yourself with what you can achieve. Even if you stumble along the way, each attempt builds your skills and confidence, bringing you closer to mastering your craft. The journey is what makes you a better actor, and every challenge is a step towards reaching your full potential. However, personal perseverance is only part of the story. To become a better actor, Michael Shirtliff reminds us that conflict is what creates drama. The more conflict actors find, the more interesting the performance. Imagine you're watching a sports match where the, both teams are evenly matched and the score is tied. The tension builds as the game progresses, each side pushing harder to gain the upper hand. It's this back and forth struggle, the conflict between the teams, that keeps you on the edge of your seat making the game exciting and memorable. So when you, as an actor, find and emphasise the conflict, whether it's internal, a character's struggle with themselves, or external, a clash with another character or situation, you bring energy and interest to the performance. Think of conflict as the fuel for your performance. The more you explore it, the more dynamic and layered your acting becomes. Whether it's a heated argument, an unspoken tension, or a character's internal battle. Finding and expressing these conflicts is what makes your portrayal gripping and real. The audience is drawn into the struggle and it's through that conflict that the true drama of the story unfolds. However, being tenacious and expertly showing conflicts at an audition might not be enough to book you the job. For this, Anne Archer gives us her sage advice on the stark reality of rejection. There are not enough good roles to go around, so there are always those who will lose out. It is part of being a performer. You must simply put it behind you and go on. Think of it like this. Imagine you're planting a garden. You carefully tend to each seed, but not every seed will sprout and grow into a flower. Some may not take root, despite your best efforts. However, you don't stop gardening just because a few seeds didn't grow. Instead, you continue to plant and nurture new seeds, knowing that some will blossom beautifully in time. In acting, each audition is like planting a seed. You invest your energy and feelings into every role you try for. But the reality is that not every audition will result in a role. Sometimes, despite your best efforts, you won't get the part. This is a natural part of being a performer, and it's important not to let these moments discourage you. Instead of dwelling on the roles you didn't get, Focus on the next opportunity. Every no brings you closer to a yes, and every audition, whether successful or not, is a chance to grow and learn. Just like in gardening, persistence is the key. Keep planting those seeds, keep auditioning, improving your craft and staying resilient. The roles that are right for you will come, and when they do, you'll be ready to shine. Unfortunately, rejection is part of the journey, but it doesn't define you. What matters is how you respond, by putting behind you and continuing forward with determination. That's how you build a successful and fulfilling career as an actor. So remember, perseverance is key to any actor's journey. Success doesn't happen overnight, 
and every no brings you one step closer to a yes. Just like in life, conflict drives drama. It's what makes stories compelling. Without challenges, there's no growth and no depth to your performance. And rejection? It's part of the craft. Every actor faces it. But how you rise after each fall is what defines you. Keep pushing through, embrace the conflict and remember that rejection is just a step towards your next great role. Keep going, your biggest achievement awaits. If you enjoyed this content, please press the subscribe button and check out Theatre Unwrapped for more community theatre videos.